October 20th at about 6.45 p.m. will remain ever fresh in the minds of Nigerian people, especially recalling how men in military uniform are the lucky two gates in Lagos open fire on peaceful protesters, killing scores and leaving others injured. It was confirmed by the protesters and other witnesses at the two gates who claimed several people were injured and killed in the shooting spree. As a matter of fact, the incident was teamed live on Instagram by DJ Switch, who was at the scene at the moment of the night where the incident occurred. She had earlier claimed that the soldiers, after shooting, took the dead bodies away. And from what she said, she saw at the scene, at least 15 corpses were on ground, which was later taken away by the soldiers, as she claimed. In another report earlier, Amnesty International also claimed 10 people were killed during the shooting at shooting that night in Lekki Togis on October 28, 2020. The Lagos State Governor Babajide Sonwulu blamed the shooting on forces beyond his control. He said no life was lost in the shooting. After much criticism, he later admitted that two people, two persons died from that shooting that claimed many lives. When he granted interview on CNN, Sonwulu continued to discredit the accounts of witnesses about the number of deaths and those injured from the shooting. According to him, no blood stain was found at the scene of the shooting when he visited the scene in the morning of October 21st. He was quoted saying, What has happened in that in what has happened is that there have been so many footages that were seen that people have shown, but we have not seen bodies. We have not seen relatives. We have not seen anybody truly coming out to say I am a father or a mother to someone and I cannot find that person. Nobody has turned up. I have been to the ground. There is no scratch of blood anywhere there. On their part, the Nigeria army had earlier denied non-presence non of soldiers at the Lekki Togit that night. The Nigeria Army later admitted that soldiers were deployed on the request of the Lagos State Government. There is no way the truth and evidence could be hidden as eyewitnesses' accounts had shown evidence in videos of the shooting. Premium Times in their reports of investigation into the matter has indicated that a lagoon has been seen where a suspected body of a protester flew. This goes a long way to confirm earlier reports that some bodies were dumped in the lagoon. Now, this could be an eye-opener as the floating body of the suspected victim resurfaced days after the incident. In that report, Mr. Adeoye, who was at the scene where the dead body was found, said the residents suspected the floating body could be one of the protesters shot by soldiers and dumped in the lagoon close to Bay Lounge in Lekki. Hmm. Okay. Well, one thing I will say, because we have a principalities and powers who are keyboard warriors, they are going everywhere, everywhere, all the platforms, they are always going there to say, oh, na lie, na lie. But one thing that has even implicated the government and the Nigeria army, why the denier in the first place? Someone who just came that very morning, as it happened not quite long, he just concluded, no investigation whatsoever, just concluded, bam, nobody died. <laughs> but why did he change his mind? Why did he change his heart? And again, the the army too, they said they were not there. So is that the kind of people that you want to trust in the first place? That they said they were not there. At the end of the day, they said uh, they were there, that it was the governor that ordered them to come. Again, the governor said he didn't know anything about it. You see what has been happening. At some point, oh, they said, oh, they were, they didn't, they didn't shoot at anybody. That it was a, they were shooting in the air. Oh, they said, you know, you can imagine. So is that the kind of people you want to trust? People are calling for the head of a DJ switch. And meanwhile, they have been, they have not been consistent from the beginning. People who are not consistent from the beginning are this the person that you want to trust. You, you can imagine they were now doing a, a I that sick game. They said they, they panel set up. Who set up the panel in the first place? Is it not the same, the government that set up the panel? At the end of the day, they said they went to, uh, what is it called? The Nigeria Army uh, a mortuary to go and find out this and that. They were telling, oh, even this place has been on renovation for a very long time. Who are they deceiving? 
for the fact that you were denying and you are saying nothing of such happened and you were there and you now agree to the fact that this and that and if people saw it and they were telling us that a photo should uh, be photoshopped everything was photoshopped so <clears throat> nigeria cannot you can't believe the government for you for the fact that you are lying about it nobody is going to believe you they are selling so only was just talking just, just the yan the yan which they are not even just the yan you know you just know that somebody just speaking like a baby say one thing in the morning in the afternoon you are saying another thing the H security officer of the state is telling us that he didn't know that uh, the army came there the army came and said oh you are you invited them the government the state government invited them and some people are see, being daft saying that uh, oh even if he had invited them but why did this feign ignorance in the first place saying if he had invited them he didn't tell them to shoot you can imagine kind of that kind of talk that kind of talk you say you were not there and again now the army is angry now that uh, amnesty international got to know how they moved from that place to that place and they said they were never denying it so what do you say about that hmm. well your governor invited the military to kill your children on a peaceful process and dump their bodies in the lagoon may you never have this type of may we never have this type of governor again in lagos truth is, is gradually coming out hmm. truth is gradually coming out uh consequence of voting for bad governors when you have a leader that love money more than justice and humanity what do you expect eh, hashtag napc the truth will always come come god will fight for dj switch they are our heroes we the mothers are praying for all our justice league in the in this nation the truth is like the smoke is coming out one day it's going to come out god almighty will judge the murderer son Wulu the entire APC politician and so-called useless military men who can't protect their own citizens. After how many days is the floating corpse? Let's not put petrol in a burning fire. Any dead body in the, in water will float maximum three days. It's just now after nothing was found at the military uh, mug. That is not the issue. Whether people found whatever or whatever at the end that they may be floating somewhere it is inconsequential were they there did they should that is the question those who are in the hospital we know that people are in the hospital because people are just trying to trivialize this whole thing those who are in the hospital why would you shoot them in the first place why why were they lying why were they lying hmm. so someone is not saying politicians god will disgrace all of you what of the case of chibo guests and all those who all those bandits that are killing you people shall not go unpunished with all your generation tell all the protesters not to hide not hid that shall not be uncovered are we what is someone trying to tell us i know and i believe that god shall move mountains on lakey shooting massacre all we need is prayer i'm just happy for dj switch that some nigerians do not believe her story really Hey, you and your cohorts not believe in DJ Switch footage about Lekki Massacre. The blood of the innocent shall speak against them. Say to the wicked, there is no peace for them forever. You will not believe it was on, on life. Then they should... My goodness, it's unfortunate. So guys, let us hear your opinion on this. Leave your comment below and let us know your thoughts. Thank you.